the first REIT in the country to enter as public. As the Securities and Exchange Commission approved the listing of Ayala Land subsidiary, the AREIT of Ayala Land focuses on leasing property in the metro. The three commercial properties in Manila namely, Solaris One, Ayala North Exchange and McKinley Exchange. The 59% of the tenant compose of BPO outsourcing. The public offering will be on July 27th to 31 and listing in the Philippine Stock Exchange will be on August 7th. The maximum price at 30 pesos per share. Good things about AREIT of Ayala Land. Most of the BPO tenant have a long-term leasing. Low debt. Meaning they have a room to borrow money to extend capital expenditure. AREIT does not have any POGO tenants. A significant increase in office vacancies brought about by the closure of POGO. Meaning, since the POGO in the country threatening to leave the country the AREIT. A Viala land is a risk-free to POGO. Dividend yield averaging to 4.6%. Soon acquisition of Teleperformance in Cebu. Award-winning for its significant performance in revenue management. Market share, capabilities, and overall contribution to the contact center industry. Since it is a subsidiary of Ayala Land, they have the expertise to manage property leasing. Since majority of the revenue of Ayala Land came from property leasing, since we do all know the good things about AREIT of Ayala Land, let's take a look how they underperform in this factor. Since AREIT considered as small gross floor total area leasing, if you are planning to hold to midterm to long term, the AREIT offers you a buying on a premium side. The risk of flat earnings in the short term. Since the COVID-19 mostly hit the property sector, the tenant of casual dining in some floor area will be closed from the past three months. They result a reduce in revenue. The acquisition of Teleperformance in Cebu is good. But once the acquisition is granted it will now challenge how the ability of the company to expand in BPO sector. Nowadays since COVID-19 hits most businesses. The business expected to trim down cost. It will affect to the short term. Dividend yield averaging to 4.6% is good. But is it lower compared to other yield averaging 5 to 6%? Meaning the dividend yield is not much attractive. Final thoughts. Why you should invest in midterm or long term in AREIT. A Viala land. When there's a lot of stocks property company out there if you look at the other property stocks that is under value. Why you should buy the AREIT. When you have Ayala land in your portfolio or Ayala Corporation, if you are planning to trade and speculate stock, just remember follow risk management. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to AA Vista.